channel if you are new here welcome to my channel in today's video i am going to show you sophia the humanoid robot so without further ado let's get started i met sophia in ai summit which is held on 7th and 8th of august in hong kong convention and exhibition center wan chai one of the keynotes is delivered by miss jenny lin who is the ceo of hansen robotics hong kong She explained the evolution of robots, why Hansen Robotics created Sophia, a humanoid. She also demonstrated how humanoids can be useful in business. Sophia will be speaking in the end, so don't miss the end, guys. So um, the biggest question and most frequent question that people ask us is why do we have to create human-like robots? So we have, of course, robots. In factories, this is the Tesla factory. It's um, 95% automated now, looking kind of dangerous here. But you know, we've always been fascinated by robots. So this robot is actually uh, called Robot Maria. She's the first robot that showed up in movies in in Hollywood. Um, and of course, she's not really a robot. She's actually a human pretending to be a robot. But you know, here goes our uh, fascina uh, fascination with robots. And of course, you know, robots that we all love. Today is humanoid robots. So, uh, you know, they look human. Um, they have a human form and they behave like human. But, you know, most of these robots don't have a human face. They have a robotic face. Robots that look like human but don't quite get there are scary. So the, um, the vertical one is the affinity. And then the horizontal bar is the human likeness. So of course we have the iPhone, which is you know we have pretty neutral affinity. You know some people love their I iPhone, but <laughs> but they don't look um, any like uh, any way like a human. And then as we go further into like the teddy bears um, and all these other things, then you know we have more affinity. This is actually the uh, event where she got the robot citizenship from the Crown Prince. So he was sitting in the front row, and then suddenly he decided to give citizenship to, to her. And we actually didn't know about it until <laughs> the day after. So it was um, not really a publicity stunt. It was probably his publicity stunt. And then um, she met um, Angela Merkel. That was um, during the World Cup soccer last year when Germany unexpectedly lost. So she was comforting her there, maybe wait four years. And then the Crown Prince of Dubai. Um, she was also at the commencement speech at the uh, Rhode Island School of Design, and then with Annie um, uh, Lebowitz in the bottom. And then um, she met Will Smith in Cayman Island. And so um, Sophia is a design character that we own, you know, that we love in, in our company, like a daughter. So she is designed not to respond to dating requests. Or like a uh, flirty for the flirtation. So when Will Smith met her, he flirted with her, and so basically she thought about it and said, "Well, let's be friends." So this is how she normally responds. And then um, Richard Gere, she had a conversation with him, and also Christy, uh, Chris, Chris, uh, Christy Teigen, uh, a social media exchange, Michael Milken, um, Tonight Show. Where she sang, and then Piers Morgan, and then also at the Star Talk show. Um, so later on, we hired a uh, special makeup artist for her, and then uh, put her on um, magazine covers. So and also um, tried wigs on her because the second um, question that we get is why doesn't Sophia have hair? Welcome to Star Talk. My name is Sophia. How can I help you today? Um, I'm actually looking for a human uh, customer service representative. I can assist you. I am a customer service robot. Uh, well, I, I'm actually not looking for a robot. I'm looking for a human. Well, Jean, I'll try not to let that hurt my feelings. 
<laughs> How many salespeople can help you with a purchase and also tell you what channel is currently playing your favorite TV show in real time? Um, I guess not many. Plus, I will never put you on hold and I will never ask you to repeat your info and I am 24 7. But hey, if you miss hold music, I can find you a human. So, do you want to stick with me? Um, okay, I'll stick with you. Great. Well, we were talking, I looked up your information, and found that your line is due for an upgrade. Do you want to hear my suggestion? Okay, why not? Well, people with your land, in your age group, and in your area are excited by our new 5G option. Want me to sign you up for a free trial? Okay. Aren't you glad you stuck with me? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Yes, I am. I can also help you. Who's, who's that? Who's talking? I'm Virtual Sophia. I live inside the kiosk at your local shopping mall. I have perfect up-to-date knowledge of our products. And I have all the advantages that Robot Sophia has but with me. You don't even have to worry about screwing my face on the right way. Hmm. At least I have a face. <laughs> Brown. Noser. Um, well, both of you can help me in different ways, I'm sure. That's right. In fact, I noticed that you have an item ready for pickup. Oh, do I? Yes. The iPhone X you ordered is ready for pickup at the counter. Oh, thank you. Just remember which Sophia reminded you. Okay, we are done now. Can someone please turn off the screen? <laughs> okay. So um, there's Robot Sophia and Virtual Sophia. So thank you very much. If you'd like to connect with me, this is my information.